Hi, I'm Chris Taylor and I'm with Captain Jack here. It's a bright and early morning back in Portland. We're heading out to Astoria, Oregon for the final part of Dribble Oregon's 2013 tour of the state of Oregon. We're here at uh, Fort Stevens State Park near Astoria. It's a beautiful place and uh, ready to plant some trees. Folks, grab some shovels. It's my first time to do it, so I'm excited about it. Here you go, dude. Thank you. These are shore pines, so they do pretty well over here. I got to zoom in on Jack, tweet his picture. I'm a rookie in the tree planting business. What do you think, is that about right? <laughs> Look at that, I'm done and Chris hasn't even started. Look at Chris's. <laughs> nice. Don't let us, it get you. There you go. Yay. All right. Good job. Yeah. Oh, now what do you do? Bury it. All right. <laughs> Thank Good you. job. High five. Thank you. Yeah, we're lopping the scotch broom. Basically, it kind of comes into an area and just takes over. Ooh, timber. Uh, you got a few discoveries of little pines. Like, see these pines here behind you? We weren't seeing those before, so it's a yard work with a purpose. Just uh, say this little guy from all the scotch broom that's been growing up around it, as you can see, it's probably almost eight feet tall in some spots, and the sunlight doesn't get into these trees. Hopefully grow up to be big and strong just because we uh, cleared all this stuff out. The tail end of two, year two, Dribble, Oregon. Thank you all very much for coming out. Boom. Anyone need a haircut? <laughs> We're all done here out at Fort Stevens, planting trees and lopping bushes. We're heading out to Astoria High School to get started with the kids camp. So you know when you scrimmage and you play a game? Okay. We'll have to learn that then. Okay, ready? And go. Good pass. <laughs> Magic powers. Good job. Yeah. Ooh, what a shot. And today we learned a lot of basic skills, but you could see that a few things um, really clicked for them, and you hope they walk away from this uh, with a smile, but also learning something along the way. Oh, he got it! Working around, Blue. Working around. You guys have gone through three other stations, passing, dribbling, juggling. So try to use all those things that you learned in those other stations and incorporate them into the game you play. We had four coaches from our ODP program come out here and show the kids a lot of fun, running them through a bunch of different games. And the kids had a blast doing it with a bunch of smiles on their faces. One, two, three. Go Timbers! Last stop of the day here in Astoria, heading over to the Wet Dog Pub. Meet some fans, take some questions. Uh, and just have a good time. Thank you! If you were stuck on an island, which two players would you take with you? One, first, for protection purposes only, David Horst. I don't think a bear would attack that man. And if I was behind him, I feel like I might be able to survive. All right. Thank you. Thank you, awesome. guys. Well, here we are, Timbers fans. We're at the end of Dribble Oregon 2013, brought to you by Jeldwin Windows and Doors. We have had an incredible time. We have been to Vancouver, to Pendleton, to Medford, Eugene, Kalamath Falls. We're closing it up here in Astoria, Oregon. We've had a wonderful time with Friends of Trees. Our clinics have been incredible. The players who got to come out have had a wonderful time, and we hope to see you again next year.